Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are new, welcome to my channel. I'm so happy to have you tuning in, tuning on for this uh, Old Navy haul. Yeah, you got it up there. It's an Old Navy haul. We're excited, so excited. Um, for those of you who don't know me, my name is Carrie Kemp. I am a plus size model in Toronto. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it about me. Uh, I'm super excited about this haul. I found my first dupe. You guys, I was so excited. If those of you who do not know what a dupe is, it is basically finding the exact same item. So in this case, um, it was a piece of clothing that is very, very similar to something that's more expensive. So it was actually half the price. I'm not going to lie to you. It, and it's like a significant half the price. It, it, you ain't saving just five dollars here. No, 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 no. Your girl has your bag. I got you. It was a lot of money. So I'm super excited for you guys to watch for that. Um, but for those of you who are new, uh, I do my measurements so that you guys know what size I am. So today I am wearing a bra. This top is from Fashion Nova. And these leggings, well, I think, if you guys have watched my videos before, you know where these leggings are from. Or if you follow me on Instagram, they're Carrie Kemp, you know where these leggings are from. Good old fashioned Costco. Um, so 43 is my bust. And then I go to the smallest part of my waist and it is 38. And then I go around my belly because I do have a bigger belly. It is 52, just under 52, but we'll go 52 just to be safe. And then this bouteille is 53. So those are my measurements. Um, if you have any questions at all, don't hesitate to ask me down below. Make sure that you are following on my Instagram. Also, something that I don't mention that they're like, you need to be mentioning this in YouTube videos. Hit the subscribe like subscribe and the notification bell and all that kind of stuff. I think it's like down in this corner here. Uh, definitely subscribe to my channel. I just reached over 500 followers and, or followers, subscribers. You can tell I'm an Instagram hoe. Um, 500 subscribers and it just like makes me so excited that that many people actually like watching my videos and my content. Um, although I'm not getting paid for any of this. Um, I really love doing this. I love bringing you guys um, different ideas, especially now that fall's coming in. And it's like my, it's not my favorite season. Summer is my favorite season, but fall fashion is my favorite fashion season. Like just seeing what's coming out, the hot colors, all that kind of stuff. It makes me all excited. Uh, let me know if you guys think the same as me, if you guys like fall fashion and summer as a uh, season. Actually, I know like people out west from Saskatchewan, my brother is actually one of them, he likes winter and I'm like, who are you? And like if you guys understood Saskatchewan winter, it's nothing to mess around with. Like last year it was so cold out there, I think they told me that it was like minus 50 for almost three weeks straight, ridiculousness. <laughs> This is why I moved away, is just for the weather. Nothing else, just for the weather. I'm like, I need to go somewhere where there is better weather, and Toronto has that for me, so thank goodness. Because, ugh, that winter, it almost killed me. Anyway, before I ramble on and on, you guys know how I like to ramble, I'm going to get trying on some clothes. Um, it was in their change room, um, so I'm sorry if, uh, that you can hear music and stuff. I tried to, I tried to speak as loud as I could. I'm mumbling. You guys just watch the video and I hope you guys enjoy it. All right. All right. So first off, we have this plain basic tank. I had a lot of people ask me about the Target tank that I bought on my trip. This is very similar. So if you can't get to a Target, this is $9.99 Canadian. And this one is an extra large. They do have it in an XXL and so many different colors, but I just wanted to show you the fit. I really like the fit of it on me. I like the length of it. It goes down to my mid booty. I'll get nice and close there. But yeah, outfit number one. Let's move on. 
All right, all right, so here's the next shirt. This is, I'm gonna do all the fitness stuff first and then I'm gonna move into like fall fashion. So this is fitness. Um, this shirt is an extra large, it is $20. These pants are an XXL and they are $45, both Canadian. So this shirt says passion, power, and purpose. I think I'm gonna get this one because I just love that reassurance when you're working out, reading those words while you're working out, just knowing what you're doing it for, and um, just loving yourself while you're wearing it. So this shirt is coming home with me. I like the fit of it. I think it's gonna be great for working out. These pants are nice and high-waisted. They are called the legging sculptant elevate leggings <laughs> i was reading the french side because i do that elevate leggings they come up super high i would personally get um, a size smaller just because they are a little bit big but i don't feel like they are very breathable so for 45 dollars i would rather my costco leggings to be honest with you um, but they do have pockets, which the Costco leggings don't. So I'm super impressed with that. And they do pass the squat test. I'm wearing super bright underwear because you know how we do. We gotta do the squat test in super bright underwear so that if they do come through, you would be able to see it, but I'm not able to. So they do pass the squat test, but unfortunately they're just, like they're starting to sag and I've like pulled them up all the way. and They're just not very breathable, but I do like pockets. So there you go. Let's move on to the next outfit. All right, so next they, we have this shirt. I do love the back of it, how it goes in like a V and um, nice and low, but I'm not a big fan of these. They have so many different um, kinds of this and uh, you can tie both sides of it, but then it just like hugs the biggest part of me. So just, not a big fan of that but it is $25 if you do personally like it you could always leave it untied like I have it now and it's not as bad but it's just not my personal style and then these leggings are $25 they do not pass the squat test these are in an extra large if I got them in a size bigger they would be too big on me uh, $25 and um, they're called the balance leggings. I really like the feel of them, but they got a passer squat test, you know? Like you can see like just my skin, let alone any underwear. So um, that is it for fitness attire. I wanted to show you that. The other shirt that I'm gonna get, it uh, comes in a lot of different sayings and all that kind of stuff as well. So make sure you check those out because they're adorable this not a big fan of my personal opinion not a big fan of it and these leggings so um, I'm gonna move along to fall fashion okay so next I have on this net sweater it is an extra large it's nice and baggy as you can see it is a beautiful coral color I don't know if it's coming out in um, the video but they have it in so many different colors and I feel like it's very close to, it's not as fitted as the one at Additionnel, but it is very close to it. The sleeves are longer, but they are a little bit too poofy. So it is uh, $50. And then I paired it with these jeans. These are their famous Rockstar jeans. And so um, I got a size 18, they're super skinny. Um, they are the perfect length on me, however, this booty. I need high-rise jeans for this booty. So um, these jeans would be, every time I'd sit, they would like ride down every time and I would have to go pull up the booty. You guys know how it is. They're $50 as well. So I'm just, overall I'm not like super happy with either of these pieces. If I was to choose between this top and the additional one, I liked the fit of the additional one a little bit better. Uh, even though these uh, sleeves fit me, it's just a little bit too baggy and it makes me, if I feel like it makes me look a little bit bigger than I am, which I'm not for that look. But overall, if these jeans were a little bit higher up, I think I would really like them. But 
they're nice and stretchy they have them in so many different styles so if you don't mind the mid-rise and you don't have a, as big of a booty as me these jeans actually are pretty pretty decent but let me know what you think all right so next i'm going to move into this i'm like obsessed with this color like i cannot wait to get this color in like every thing um this is a large it has little slits in the side and i think that it goes down a nice length it's nice and fitted the arms fit nicely i really like it i like the v i wish that this seam wasn't here you guys know how i feel about the middle seam I'm not a big fan but uh overall i, I do really like this sweater and i the price wasn't on the tag, unfortunately. I think it was like 20 bucks or something like that. It was reasonable. I mean, I think everything at Old Navy is reasonable, but it's just not quality in my opinion. Like everything that I've received, gotten at Old Navy never ever lasts. So you have to take the good with the bad, right? Okay, so next I'm pairing this, it's just a tank top, which I'll show you in a second, with this white jean jacket. This jean jacket is in an extra large, it is $50. This tank comes in a million different colors, and I think it was $10 again, it's not on the tag, so I apologize for that. But what do you guys think of this look? You could also like tuck this in and have that, and it would look so cute. I'm just loving this whole look. The tank top is, or the tank top, the jean jacket is not stretchy, but I feel like just leaving it like by a size down and leaving it open looks super cute because then it fits your arms and it just, it hangs properly I think, but you could always size up so that you can do it up if you wish. I just love this look. Okay, now I'm going to quickly show you the tank top. Okay, so here is the tank top. I absolutely love the length of it, love the fit of it. Um, this is a large, like I told you, I think it's around the $10 range. And they have it in a million colors. It's nice, roomy, sits nice. It's a great piece to layer over top of for fall. And the color, the color is everything. It's like, I don't even know how to describe it. It's like a pink, pale pink y, like kind of skin tony. Super cute. Okay, so next I wanted to show you this uh, army green jacket. I absolutely love the color. They have it again in so many colors. It is $55. I'm trying on the extra large. And it is actually at least a size too big on me, so I would definitely recommend sizing down for this. Usually for jackets, I'm like XXL um, because of my booty, but this one has room around my my booty. These pockets are real; these pockets are not, unfortunately. But you could always cinch in the waist straight here, and you just tie it how you need to tie it. If there's a tie on both sides. For $55, I think that this is a great fall. It doesn't have a hood, which I prefer jackets with hoods, to be honest. But I think it is great. They have a beautiful yellow one, but they didn't have it in an extra large, so. But I like it. It's a cute, eh? Okay, so the last jacket thing is this beautiful vest. It is not as soft as it looks. It feels more like sheep fur than like a super soft which you'd want it to be for <laughs> but I love the coloring of it it is $55 I have it in an extra large it's a little bit snug down here um, what I would personally do is uh, size down and just have it open for styling and layering I think that it's a cute layering piece I just wish it was softer. But if it's cute, does it need to be soft? I don't know. Okay, so here is one of the two jumpsuits that I'm trying on. And they have it in this color, a solid red, and then a tan and white striped. And 
I find that it just like hides my VBO so I wouldn't need to necessarily wear shapewear underneath it. Um, it's $45 Canadian. I don't know, I kind of like it, like with some leopard heels or something, or some little booties. Yeah, I mean, I feel like jailbait, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, black and white jailbait. But, I feel like you could totally dress this up and look hella cute. Like, to tone down it, just like throw a cardigan over top of it, have some like leopard little booties, but... I don't know, I, something about this, I'm, I'm actually kind of liking it. Okay, let's get to the last outfit, which is another jumpsuit. You guys, is this not a dupe from Torrid? It is, 100%. So the Torrid one was $100. This is a size too big on me, at least a size. Um, it's an extra, extra large. It is $55, so half the price for like the same look. It's got pockets, you could belt it. Um, it's an elastic here, but if this was like fitted, they just didn't have my size or else I would have totally duped it. But, and then what I did was I just tied the top just to try and give it a little bit more shape for you. But if you guys like that toward one, come to Old Navy because it, it's pretty much the exact same thing, I'm not gonna lie. Half the price. I found a dupe. It's my first dupe. I'm so excited. I just wish it was fitted. Because if it was, like, I'll give you an idea of it being fitted. Like... I'm not gonna lie, I'm super impressed with myself. As soon as I seen it, I'm like, <gasps> a dupe, no way. I was so excited. Winning, winning. Cool, very cool. Makes me happy. Well guys, what did you think? Was that dupe a dupe or a dupe? Cause I'm sure it was a dupe. Sorry, I wanted to say that three times in one sentence, and I did it. Yay! Uh, so yeah, saving $50, and I didn't even realize how, how similar they were until I put the two photos side by side, and I'm like, other than the buttons in the front, they're pretty much the exact same jumpsuit. I'm not gonna, one was a lot bigger on me because they didn't have my size, but woof, woof, cause woof. It, that was insane. I was so excited when I like put it on. I'm like, oh my God. And $50 savings. Like, when are you really going to wear that jumpsuit? Like, it's like for outings. So, and it's like a one season thing. Like, I feel like, I don't know, maybe you'll wear it for more than one year. But I'm one of those people. I like to get new stuff every season now. I used to not be like this. And, uh, but working in the fashion industry, it has me changing my mind on it. I like to be current. <laughs> yeah, my bank account doesn't like it, but that's okay. That's okay. Um, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure that you like it, subscribe it, hit the notification bell, all of that fun stuff. Follow me on Instagram, the Carrie Camp, the Carrie Camp, just like that. Um, and... Yeah, I hope you guys have a fantastic week. I will be sure to have another video come to you next Tuesday because Tuesday is my day to post. Mwah! Thank you guys all for the love, the support, and all the likes and the subscriptions and all that fun stuff. I really, truly appreciate it. I'm going to quit rambling. Have a good week.